stocks, both in the United States and in Asia, are down yesterday evening and this morning uh, on caution for the forthcoming uh, results regarding companies. The fourth quarter results are expected to be uh, below expectations and that creates uh, nervousness in the market. So both uh, Dow Jones and Nasdaq uh, as the uh, the Asian stock indexes have fallen back from their peaks. Uh, there is one interesting result uh, coming uh, today and that was from Samsung which is posting a profit on more than 8 billion US dollar for the last quarter. Uh, in the US yesterday it was uh, a rather uh, flat session. On the currency front, Euro US dollar is trading in the interval between 130 and 130.40. Uh, the uh, European Central Bank is going to meet on Thursday and it is expected that the interest rate level would be kept at the same. Uh, there is also expectations that the uh, ECB would not come with any comment that could uh, create impression for an interest rate hike in the nearest future. If that's going to be the situation, uh, the euro is probably going to rise during the week up to 130.50 on expectations or no changes. Uh, the yen is also a somewhat stronger again today against the US dollar after reaching 88.40 on Friday. It's now trading at 87.50. There is strong resistance on 86.50 and it's expected that this resistance level would be tested after very, ga very strong gains being posted over the last two months. Only in December the uh, USD uh, increased 7% against the yen. Commodities are uh, steady. Uh, copper prices are a little bit up uh, after uh, indications that uh, the Chinese gross domestic product would be uh, on a yearly basis around 7.